Are we going through... What? Is this a person? It's I like think that's us. With a cape. Maybe it's us. Oh, no. this is weird. I've been really looking forward to this game. She looks like a geisha. She is a geisha! Or is she? No. I Turned her head a little bit too much. I saw the little, the little obi. Isn't that the thing that goes around the waist? Mm hmm It looks like she was wearing a kimono. Yeah. So... And she was wearing her hair in the style of a yeah. geisha. Yeah, so it's like, this is us. Oh, we're wearing, like, a little raincoat. And look the way she runs. That's very much like a little kid. We were sleeping in a suitcase. That's very sad. Hmm. So... Are we we didn't have an option for subtitles, so I assume there's no dialogue in this game. So maybe this will be kind of like inside, where we just have to figure. Whoa. Ew. Figure it out. All right, I'm already enwrapped. Uh, this is a full let's play. Sorry, guys. <laughs> Are you trying to see how long it takes to beat? Yeah. This is cool. I'm I'm loving it already. Oh. Oh, cool. Look, Stacy. Yeah. I can go. I didn't even know I could do that. Oh, look at the lighting and the dynamic shading in this game. This is great. Look how sharp those shadows are. Usually they're like blurry and stuff. Hmm. Looks like it's about four hours. We could do that. So this light's on. There's no instru- Oh, I think we're on a boat. Yeah, that's what I was thinking, because we're kind of like tipping. Maybe we should check the other uh, areas. <clears throat> I love that she's barefoot. Oh. Hold RT to grab. Okay. Game's like, um, you're an idiot. <laughs> you need help. <coughs> there we go. Can we take the thingy with us? Mm, nope. Nope. All right. Oh, okay. This is crouch. So we're hiding on a ship in a raincoat, and we were sleeping in a suitcase. Can I climb those walls? No. I wonder if this will make my light go out. It doesn't. I wonder what we're doing here. Do we stow away? This feels like one of those games that takes place in a dream or something, you know? Yeah. This kind of reminds me of Rule of Rose, which is a underappreciated survival horror game for the PS2, which was, like, really fucked up. I think I played it with you once, and you were like, what is happening? No, you streamed it. And yeah, I but I, I quick looked at once with you, and you were like, um, this is the weirdest game ever. Huh. This reminds me of Inside a lot. Yeah. Is this made by the same people? It can't be. It's too soon. I don't think so. Hmm. This is from Tarsier Studios. Ooh, oh, it's a creepy geisha doll. Oh, weird. <gasps> Ooh, I have it now. Oh. Ooh. Ooh, I kicked it. It's probably going to get mad at me. We're going to make it looks mad, like there's and a... then we're going to be... We're going to get possessed or something. Okay, so there's a crack in the wall over here. Oh, 
I wonder if there's anything I need I can do with this. Tarsier Studios also did Little Big Planet. Ah, that makes sense. All right, here we go. I have a feeling this next room's gonna be scary. Okay. Oh, not a leather couch is a good place to keep cigarettes. I hear. Hmm. This is creepy. <laughs> what was that? It's, it was a uh... something walking past. Oh, but it's like it was walking past the door. Yeah. I wonder if I need to, like, hide underneath the bed or something. Okay. I guess my question is, is this a... Is this a dream? Is this actually happening? It feels like one of those things... <gasps> oh! <laughs> this, got, this got to be a dream. It looks like people... Look at the bendiness... Of the architecture and stuff. Oh, yeah. That thing bending off into the distance. There, there's two of them bending like that, so it feels like a dream. Look how, and look how big everything is compared to her. It shouldn't be that big. Yeah, I mean, we are a child, clearly, but... The, the toilet paper roll is half our size. Yes. You know, but I think that that also kind of plays on the idea that for children, everything feels super huge. Do you know what I mean? Yeah. Oh, did you see the eye on the door? Is it moving? No. no. That'd be really great if it was moving. Oh, we probably have to push the chair over to reach the knob. Yep. Well, it feels like... See, that guy has a mattress here with toilet paper. So what exactly is the situation on this ship, you know? Yeah, I mean, I assume it's a ship just from the way it's kind of rocking around and everything. It feels like a ghost ship, if that makes sense. Yeah. My controller's Whoa. rumbling. I don't know what that means. the sludge bad? Seems like it might be bad. Ooh. Ooh! Oh. Something came out of the sludge. Yeah. Ooh! That looks like uh, somebody got dragged. Oh, uh, now we have footprints. That's bad. No, but you see, it looks like somebody... Look, somebody walked out of the sludge, and then they got grabbed, and they tried to be... Uh oh. Let's turn that light off. But do you see it looks like they <gasps> What? There's oh. feet at the top. This has to be a dream, right? Yeah, well those are shoes. With feet in them. How do we know if there's feet in them? I can see the skin. Okay. It just looks like the top of shoes to me. But I mean, it made the noise as if those are feet, so... Like, uh, are you shocked? Shock their feet! This reminds me of a... Not a... Oh. Oh. Oh! That does not seem good. D get away. F stay away from that. I kind of want to see what it does, but I don't. Yeah. <laughs> This don't is really stressful. Don't you remember in uh, Inside when it was like, oh, a mermaid, is that like... <laughs> yeah. Watch out! Ah! But ah! Remember that mermaid was trying to help us all along? The one of them was. Still unsure about the character motivations for that mermaid. Because all the other ones killed you. But maybe it was the same one, man. It's just misunderstood.
So all I know is that in the trailer there were like big scary dudes and I don't want to deal with that. Okay. But I guess we do have to. What is this place? Do you think everyone's like taken over by like weird alien parasites? I I, like I thought it was just for sure like that those are some type of slug alien. Oh my god, kind of like in Star Trek how they take over your brain. Yeah, the first in the first season. And um and then they, you know, take over Star- Starfleet High Command and and Riker has to pretend to have a slug in his head and he has to eat maggots. Exactly. Ooh. I don't like that. It reminds me of that one weird short animation. <gasps> I'm covered in the stuff. Oh no. Oh no! Oh no, they're everywhere! Oh, if, if just one touches you, you're fucked. Ugh. Hmm. Maybe that's... Oh, so we have to get out of here somehow. Oh. Uh. Uh. Ah. Sorry. It's gross. Yeah. That's what it is. They look like, almost like leeches, but like the size of our body. You don't. Oh, oh, God, I forgot to turn on the light. Yeah. Oops. Alright, there's a few things I want to try, so we're obviously going to die a few times, but. Yeah, they definitely look like leeches. Oh. Okay, I can. Jumping is essential, apparently. So they won't come out here. I wonder why. Maybe they're just like, the video game designer said no. <laughs> yeah, or maybe, I don't know, they might, maybe they don't like the wood. Who knows? Oh, there's look, a lamp. They, look, there are footprints are covered in the weird black slime. There was a news Go story of people. Turn peop- on the lamp. Oh, good, good idea. There was a news story of somebody. What the fuck? Oh. You have to hold on to R to make this work. Ooh. Ooh. I wonder what the bucket's for. Nothing, apparently. Sound design in this game is pretty wicked. But there was a news story, speaking of disembodied feet, somebody found a foot. It was just a foot, and it was still in the sneaker. Uh-huh. And everyone was like, what the fuck? Like, how did this happen? Yeah, they couldn't find the rest of the body. And then they just theorized that, like, it was somebody who was hit by a car so hard that their foot flew off into the woods. Oh, and then they just never went and found it? No, well, the person was dead, so I oh. don't know. Oh. I don't remember the full story, so maybe I'm starting an urban legend. And I guess we don't, you know, submit photos. There's no way of knowing, Stacy. There's just no way of knowing the truth. Well, we don't, so it's not like we have footprints of ourselves anywhere that they could check, like, fingerprints. I'm sure you could look up the story and actually figure out what it is. Or should we keep it a mystery to make this Let's Play more scary? Which one? Which one should we do? And we don't have I to don't... finish this today. Yeah. I just, I'm really enthralled by this a lot. seems ominous. Yeah, I like, know. Like, there's light, but... Ooh, ooh, the door's closing. Ooh. Hmm. Wait, wait, wait. Uh, hmm. Is there a way for me to sprint, I wonder? Or is there something to put underneath that so that the thing can't go around like a box? Hmm. You know, that way the thing can't turn around? Let me think. Do you know what I'm saying, though? Yeah. I wonder. Oh, 
Go! Go! Hmm. This seems like it's a puzzle or something. It's looking for a box. Nothing that I can... Because it would have to be... Is there a way for me to run? Like, let me check the controls or something. Crouch, slide, grab, sprint! Ah, there we go. I bet we're gonna... How many times do you think we get crushed in that door before we do it right? Mm, three. Well, now you tell me? Huh. Oh, am I dead? Oh. Yeah. I think it might be like a... Look, see, we're waking up. This has to be a night... Oh, because it's called Nightmare. Duh. Little Nightmares. Little Nightmares. Like Nightmares for a Little tiny child. person. Ah, oh, there we go. There I had to press I had to press the slide button. You can do it. Oop. Weird. Maybe that's not the one. I know, but I just you know how I am. If you clearly have to go through the hole, but want to see what my other options are. There's got to be an Easter egg over here or something. Maybe. Doesn't look like it. Oh, a little airplane. Probably should have thrown it from the top, but whatever. Cool. Mm. Did it. The Easter egg was found, guys. Yep. We're going to make a whole separate hour-long video just talking about how you can get to throw the paper airplane. <laughs> get away man I don't like that sound I think we got to go towards it though I don't want to I don't want to go towards it Ugh, can we just do it <laughs> okay we just run towards it see what happens yep wow that's clearly meant to look super creepy do you feel creeped? Yeah, I'm interested to know. I mean, if this is all just a dream, like, that's cool. I guess. But what is, why are we having the dream? Yeah. We're gonna have some sort of horrible breakthrough. Like, we died on a ship or something and all our family's dead. Like, what are the eyes oh, mean, man? Oh, why would we be dreaming if we're dead? You know what I mean. No, I d do dead people dream? Maybe we're in purgatory. That's possible. It's a bathroom. I can hear people walking around, and it's freaking me out. 
Oh, okay. It's just an electrified fence. <laughs> Woof! It's not steps. You did it. I wanted to see if it would set on fire. Maybe we could grab the rat and throw it over there. No. Yes. Look around by using RS. Hmm. Ah. Ha ha. We're going to regret closing that door, I think. It's creepier with the electricity on! <laughs> we got things running around in the shadows. Is that a choo choo a, train? Yeah. So what do you guys what do you think the eye means? Because it's on the doors and it's the all seeing eye. There, man. <laughs> yeah, let's play on the creepy seesaw. No, get put the blocks on the thing. Why? Cause look, okay, hold on. Oh maybe I can just jump. Yeah. Okay. No, damn it! <laughs> oh. Because the hands make me think that being on top of that shelf is important and it looks like it wants me to be on top of the shelf. Okay. <sighs> Fuck. I mean, we didn't even look at what's uh, in the rest of the room. I know. I'm scared though, so. Damn it! I did not do that. It was the game. Somehow. It's not my fault. Yeah. You just remember it it sets you off at an angle, so you're gonna have to like Is this It's if you wanna go back through, I guess? There might be a reason why we want to go back through, so now we know. I don't know, it's set up a couple things like that so far, but not done anything. Oh! We have to get back... We have to get back through to shut off the electricity. Again. But will there be enough time? I don't know. I guess we would just have, I mean, I know that there was, there was more time than we needed, but I guess we just have to run right through the room. There's gotta be something bad that's gonna happen. There's I'm no just anticipating it. See, the thing is, for me, with 
thing with like dream sequences in games or in television shows. You're never really a fan of them. No, I'm not because they're always boring. Oh, they're never boring to me. I wonder why. It's because they're just like, oh, symbolism, blah. There's absolutely no stakes in this whatsoever, you know? Ah. Whereas it's like, I feel like whatever you're trying to say with the dream could be so much more impactful if you had something actually happen where there's... Personally, I like dreams, but I get what you're saying. Yeah. I like, I just like the... I don't like dreams in TV shows because everyone in TV shows is bad at writing and I don't give a shit if you guys are like, no, Breaking Bad's good. It's not, though. It's shit. It's all shit. Everything's shit. Am I having a bad day? Who knows? Everything's shit. Ooh. We made it. We did it. Yeah, so I just, I can't help but feeling like whenever there's like a, a dream sequence that like, I'm like, well, why should I care about what happens here? It like... Because dreams are about making an emotional breakthrough. Yeah, but it never... What Whoa. the fuck? Uh. Oh my god. What the hell? Ah. Oh my god! Oh, the cool. other ones got turned into stone too when they were seen. That's cool. Now, are you happier now? Alright, Stacy. This is not a dream. This is all real. It's a real thing that's happening to her. Yeah, I mean, as long as I pretend that it's all real and that... Uh, I think you'd like Rule of Rose because even though it's all a dream, it's her dreaming of things that actually happened to her. Ah. Uh. So you'd be like, what the fuck? <laughs> <laughs> yeah.